I'm so excited to talk about a, a new hat just arrived. Uh, today I'm wearing the calico, the Stetson calico, which I know is get a little mixed reviews. Some people yay and nay it. Um, I'm still, I'm still loving it. I'm still digging it. But here, right here, we have a uh, Nick Fouquet, my first Nick Fouquet. Um, absolutely stunning hat, and what uh, is called bone. Love this color. We have um, leather. This I really like this. So it's like this kind of has you know a little bit of that same kind of touch with this leather cord that wraps around the crown. This one has the same leather that wraps around the crown. Of course, the signature can't go wrong with that. And then this nice little touch. Of <laughs> so nice, so nice. Um, this is a diamond. That is, so we have you know a pinch here and a pinch here. Um, I, some of the hats that I have, they have a teardrop. The Stratliners, the two, two, three Stratliners that I own. This one just has a, a center crease here. Uh, this one here, we have a diamond, uh, which is really cool. I, uh, it's the first time I've experienced having a, a hat with a, a diamond crown. I like that. And um, just a nice, strong beaver felt, 100% beaver felt. And those of you who know uh, Nick Fouquet, you know uh, what it's about. Those who don't, it's okay. Look it up. <laughs> but uh, very nice craftsmanship here. Very creative. So his style, uh, he's known for quite some uh, creative and funky hats. Um, this to me, I think, is perfect because you know when you see this matchstick you know who it is and you know what he does and i just like how this one is kind of just like low-key subtle um yeah it's really really cool very excited about this one uh so let's just get some uh more details about this and take a closer look at this hat so i pulled out the stetson stratliner in silver belly that i own just to show a comparison in the colors of the felts. And you can see um, Nick is calling this uh, bone, which is lighter than the silver belly. And I know what I said about the silver belly. Yes, it was in this calico silver belly. I know what I said, you don't have to remind me. <laughs> but as you can see, this bone uh, versus the, um, stra uh, the Stetson uh, silver belly and then this bone um, the actual name of this one is Cohiba is the name of this hat and one thing that I uh, think is really curious look at the inside you have this le I like that the leather this leather band is natural so you can see like f just with a little bit of wear you see you're gonna it's gonna start to darken from the sweat and the oils um, that your forehead puts off in your hair um, so this would definitely take on a lot of characteristics um, from your your sweat and your hair and all that, the oils and all that. Uh, just look at the inside of that lining. Um, just really well done. Very excited how I'm gonna wear this and style it on my own and rock it uh, for the next uh, <laughs> 20 years, 30 years hopefully. <laughs> but uh, yeah, I just wanted to show the comparison of that. You guys can see that. So I'm gonna put it on, he on my head here, swap out the uh, calico, and throw this one on there. I think I'd wear it like kind of like this a bit. Um, you can see how that looks on, on my head. It feels really good. There may be another one, maybe. <laughs> but uh, this one's pretty cool. All right. Pardon the hat hair. I've been wearing hats all day. So let's do some uh, close up details on this uh, gorgeous thing.
Thank you so much for watching and we'll see you guys next time.